So uh, starting with the seat check, with the seat check comparison from 2013 to 2018, with Congress having 58 in th 2013 and 114 seats in 2018, and BJP with a massive 165 seats in 2013, with again 109 seats in 2018, with zero, with SP standing at zero and one seat for SP in 2018, and four seats for BSP in 2013 with a two now with the number of two in 2018 and others standing at three and four in 2013 versus 2018 respectively and this stands at total seats of 230 and now let's quickly take a look at the 2019 Lok Sabha results with Congress winning one seats out of the 29 seats, BJP garnering a massive number of 28, and then SP again standing at zero with BSP and others. Now this, these are the numbers of 2019. Now let's quickly take a look at the Madhya Pradesh 2018 versus 2019 Lok Sabha poll numbers with Congress standing at 114 and one in 2019, 109, for BJP, 109 in 2018 and 28 seats in 2019. Now, SP standing at 1 and 0 respectively in 2018 and 2019, with BSP again at 2 in 2018 and 0 at 2019, with others, in fact, getting a bit ahead 2018, with 4 in 2018. Now, let's quickly take a look at the 2018 vote share with SP standing at the standing at a 1.30%. Meanwhile, BJP with a massive number of 41.02%. Congress going standing at, standing slightly low with 40.89%, with BSP and SP sta standing together with 1.30% and 5.01%, with others, in fact, crossing a bit further with 10.43%. These are the total votes. The total vote standing at 38 crore and I mean it, it, sh it shows a massive competition between the parties. Let's quickly take now, like, now take a look at the 2018 seat share with total seats standing at 230 and halfway mark in 116. Congress having 114 seats in their pocket with BJP a bit below at 109. SP and BSP 1 and 2 respectively with others at 4. Now you can clearly see Congress sort of uh, headed ahead with the numbers last time. Over to you Devika. Okay, very interesting. Of course, uh, Ria, last time around it was the Congress party, remember, that took the majority of the seats in Madhya Pradesh, but the government did fall midway and then the BJP came to power. So will the BJP manage now to keep the voters swayed, to keep the voters persuaded? For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel, hit the bell icon.